In this video, we'll see how we can add GF3 format in WooCommerce. Like currently, when I go on checkout, you can see CGFT and FGFT apply because I'm selling in same step Delhi because my shop is in Delhi. I'm selling on same step But if I change it to some other step then you will see IGFT will apply. We'll see how to set up GFT in WooCommerce. Let's go. So here I am logged into admin dashboard of WordPress. I have installed WordPress WooCommerce. In WooCommerce, we will share how to set up GFT. Like currently in WooCommerce, first we will enable tag search. In tag search, we need to set GFT. Okay, that so we will see how we can do it. First here you get to enable tag search and rate calculation. But this doesn't give me GFT option when I go on tag, tag search. I can create here you can see different type of tag page like 15% rate, 14% like 15 but it's not a systematic way of GFT in GFT there will be two options CGFT and FGFT it will don't provide that option so we'll see how we can create it okay like when I go on 15% GFT here you can see So we'll see how we can add CGFT, FGFT with GFT full text. Okay. So we will go to plugins, click on add new. We'll install a plugin, GFT plugin with help of that. We'll set up GFT and Bookom. Okay. Here you can see WooCommerce GFT plugin. We will install it. Activate. Now plugin is installed. When you go on WooCommerce setting, you will see a GFT option here. GFT setting. Here. Here you can. GFT number if you want to display in Viva, you can enter here select probe product type multiple here you can select the tax level it is single tax level like 5% 10% or multi tax level you can set as per your requirement in multi tax level you can select multiple tax level ok GFT number okay here you can see now what I will do now I will go on tax I will show you how to create GFT here I will remove first what we need I will remove the all the taxes wait a second this my We'll do go here with all the taxes and now go to GFT setting. And now here select multiple or single as per your account. I will select multiple and create 12% and 5%. Save changes. Okay, now go to taxes. We have removed here, you see, we have removed all the taxes by default. Two GFT taxes has been created of 5% and 12%. And you go on 5%. Here you can see by default CGFT, FGFT created. You don't need to do anything. And go to 12%. Here you can get CGFT, IGFT, FGFT. You can say it state by also like in which state you are FGFT and CGFT or IGFT what will be charged on it you can set as per your requirement products Here you can see it is taxable if data taxable. 
you can set tax transform here what will be applied on it 5% or 12% like I have updated it will 12% will be applied HSC and SSC code is mandatory for GFT update it now go. what I will do in state code CGFT will applied if it is in Delhi because my shop is in Delhi okay now save changes DL for now shape changes now what will happen if it is someone shop from Delhi then CGFT FG will apply otherwise let's go to check out page here you can see 12 percent IGFT is applying because currently I am set it to Haryana what will happen if I set it to Delhi let's go. set it to Delhi 6 percent FGFT and CGFT apply now if I change it to Haryana for some other state CGFT now if I change it to Delhi again it FGFT and CGFT apply so that's why you can add CGFT FGFT feature you need to write it here like in whichever state from where you are selling there is an important factor in GFT like you have to idea about GFT then you can able to set it like GFT as you know FGFT and CG, CGFT will charge if you sell on same state now if you sell on other state then IGFT will charge that's why I have written Delhi because my shop is in Delhi I need to write Delhi and here and leave it blank because all other places other than Delhi it will be charged okay so that's how you can add GFT in your website and you can include GFT exclude GFT what fit for that you need to go to tax option here in shipping here you can see display price excluding GFT or including GFT you can set from here that point is here okay so that's all thank you for watching please like and subscribe to my channel